so look at this clip. I was playing ranked a couple days, nothing big, right? And then, but what? My bloodhound got dropped. Look at this, Jimmy. What is he doing? What is he doing? Well, wait, hold on. Hold on, who killed me? Who killed me? Uh, some random named bloodhound, right? Let's look at the Jimmy. The Jimmy was a bronze three? Wait, hold up. What? How did a bronze three get into my game? This is a little sus. Let's watch this over again. Let's watch. Look how fast the bloodhound gets dropped. But what? Look at the, uh, by the way, I killed a Jimmy. You know, but what? What? Cheaters. Cheaters. Welcome to Apex Legends in 2020. Season 8. Eight seasons in and there's still so many cheaters. The cheaters are probably at an all-time high. They're probably in every ranked game ever. Because, like, every time I run a ranked game, there's a cheater in the lobby. We got two feet. You know, we got these random cheaters in my lobby. It's just ridiculous. It's getting super old now. I get it. It was super funny when hackers were all over the game. People were like, oh, no. Like, they're making us fight and stuff like that. But at the end of the day, this is not fun no more. Like, come on. Like, we got, you know, pro players getting pissed. We got Road, who was a number one pred, saying, can a developer wake up and handle the cheaters? I know it's not your job, but the company easy anti-cheat system is not working. Um... Overall, we know it's not working, bro. It's terrible. Like, there's cheaters everywhere. There's cheaters in pubs. Why you didn't cheat in pubs? Why you didn't ruin that experience? Why you didn't ruin... Okay, if you have to cheat in this game, you suck overall. I've seen people... I've seen console players getting boosted by cheaters. Like, dog, you know you're going to get banned, right? Like, you know you're... Why? Why spend that money and time? You know you're going to get banned? Like, how... What? <laughs> I've seen a video, I lost it on Reddit, but I've seen a video of a console hacker getting into cons no, a PC hacker getting into console lobbies and hacking. Like, that's just ridiculous. That's too far. How does that even happen? How does a PC player get into console lobbies by himself? Like, what? <laughs> that's not fair, man. And he's hacking in them. That's not fair. So watch out for that, um, you console players. Because that's just a mess to as well. That's not fair. Overall, this cheating system needs to be fixed. Like, right now, we've had no devs talk about it. No devs, no Apex Legends respawn. They haven't tweeted out. They haven't talked about it. The cheating situation. And it's just terrible right now. It's at an all-time high. But uh, it really just it's super annoying. It's super demotivating to play that game. Especially, Apex Legends should be, like, getting rid of this as soon as possible. The game is growing every day. There's new players every day. Um, on Twitch, the numbers are growing. You know, everything about Apex Legends has been growing the last two seasons. But, you know, what else is growing? The amount of cheaters in the game. This needs to go. We need a better anti-cheat system on the fly. Season 9, like, soon. Soon respawn. The next thing I want to show you guys was this trailer. Because I thought it was super cool. I woke up. We got some Bane War and Wraith lore. So I'll be watching. You know, we'll play that right now. And then I'll talk about it. You guys can your thoughts on the in the comment section down below as well. And let's go. Bangalore. What's this? My knife? It's my knife. Jump jet's right there. This is a pilot's knife. Who gave you this? A pilot. I don't have time for this. Is this a data knife? I mean, what intel's on it? It's not a data knife. I checked. Now give it to me. But maybe you didn't do it right. I was a pilot. I can probably figure it out. Give me my knife, Renee. It's not yours. It's some pilot's. Let me hang on to it for two. You are not taking anything else from me. <sighs> What? Okay, whoa, 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 whoa there. Hey, okay, this isn't a playground. All right, this is a get ready for the playground ground. I mean, besides, who fights in a dropship? Yeah, really. Drop zone ahead. Prepare for your jump. Kaja. Pardon me, ladies. I got a jump to master. You knuckle draggers. Idiots. Here, take your knife. I just thought I might be able to find intel to help us both. My past, and your brother Jackson. No one gets to say his name, especially you. I'm sorry if I crossed a line, but is there something Just that I Just drop it. Let's jump and get this over. It's, it's private, and I get it. But if we're gonna fight together, I want to clear the air. Don't worry, Headcase. I haven't stabbed you in the back yet. Why start now? Okay, so this video is super cool, right? We got to see Renee, aka Rave, and then we got to see Bangalore, uh, kind of give like an explanation on how she got her heirloom. Overall, she got it from a pilot. Rafe was like, hey, you know what? Maybe that has some type of information on my bad story or your brother's bad story. And then Bangalore was like, hey, don't you ever talk about my brother, say his name, nothing, especially you. And that got me thinking, maybe Rafe and her brother had some type of like background history. Maybe they were like on the same team. Maybe like, 
um, I don't know, like, Bangalore's brother sacrificed himself for Rafe. Like, who know? We don't know. There is some bad story, and hopefully we get some more of these little small trailers, because that would be awesome, right? Like, this is what we like, or this is what we enjoy. The community really, like, grabs onto these. I grab onto them. I'm a huge fan of these little trailers. We got some Mirage and Crypto lore, too. Like, not really lore, but a little laugh, because overall we see them working together, which is always fun. But, um, yeah, I feel like we're going to get some more... Or some more information about these legends and overall let me know your guys' thoughts opinions in the comment section down below i thought it was funny i thought it was cool i thought it was great and uh, i'm excited to see what's more in the future hopefully we got some watson lore maybe some loba and revenant lore too i feel like after season five that just went down the drain like what what's the you know like what's going on about that now you know where's loba's assistant what is all that what like <laughs> there's so much that needs to be covered especially with costa too as well um so i'll see you guys later Make sure you turn notifications on. I love you guys all. Peace out.